Hi, this is John with Fender, and I'm here with Stan Cody from our Fender pedals team, and we're checking out the Fender Lost Highway phaser pedal. So what you heard up top is the pedal plugged into the Bass Breaker 30R on the Dirty Channel. We'll explore some clean tones later, but let's talk about the pedal phaser. I mean, just a classic effect. You've heard it a lot in the 60s, the 70s, 80s, and certainly uh, the modern day um, with clean tones and dirty tones. Uh, great way to add some dimension to your tone. So Stan designed the pedal, so I'm gonna let him talk a little bit about the pedal itself and the features. And one of the things that's kind of unusual about this pedal, it has two different rate and depth controls. So there's two sets of them, and the pedal lets you morph between them. So you can go from slower to faster, and it'll actually speed up or slow down, or from shallower to deeper, and the same thing. Got it. Uh, that can be controlled by a foot switch or by a dynamic feature we'll talk about. Um, there's a blend control. The blend control lets you go from either completely dry signal, just your straight guitar, or just all the way over to the filters that provide the phasing, or a 50-50 blend or any other percentage of blend. There's a feedback control that makes the sweep more uh, resonant, a mm -hmm. little deeper sounding. Um, there are switches, one for four or eight stages of phasing. Four, of course, is more subtle. Eight's mm -hmm. a little more overt. Um, there's a switch for the modulation to switch between triangle and sine wave. And really the th thing you would hear different there, the triangle modulation sweeps very smoothly from one end to the other. Um, and it sounds very even and balanced. The sine wave modulation tends to spend a little more time at the outskirts. Got so it. it's a little more wobbly when that happens. Wobbly's and then, good. Wobbly's good. <laughs> and then lastly, the dynamic sensitivity feature, this is showing up on a bunch of our modulation pedals at this point, and it's really fun. It just lets the pedal go from being slow to being fast, depending on your playing dynamics. Oh, very cool. What about the so, back panel here? We have some controls here. Yeah, the back panel has a switch for, of course, we have the LED illuminated pots. Mm -hmm. uh, you can see it on a dark stage. And then there's a boost feature on this pedal where you can add a 3 dB boost because sometimes when you blend a phaser with the dry signal, it kind of loses things in the mix a little bit. So right. it lets it just kind of pop out. And then, of course, there's a foot switch to switch between the two speed controls and a bypass, and of course, the beautiful Fender Jewel. Of course, lovely. All right, well, let's get into some tones. First off, I'm playing this lovely American performer Stratocaster HSS into the Bass Breaker 30R, this time on the clean channel. So I'll let you hear my bypass tone, and then we'll get into the pedal. <laughs> Take it away. Thanks. All right, why don't we look at what the two toggle switches do? So on this side, we have the modulation waveform. It goes from triangle to a sine. Triangle super smooth, the sine kind of lops along. So here's the triangle. I can hear that. And then the other selects four or eight stages. It's set to eight right now. Right, so I can hear that. The eight definitely sounds richer and deeper. Along with the beautiful Fender amp jewel, there are also two foot switches. There's the traditional bypass foot switch. This is a true bypass pedal. Oh, very cool. And then there's a slow fast foot switch. Nice, that's a very smooth speed up and slow down. Very cool feature. Stan, you know me, I love a great distorted tone. So let's switch over to the gain channel of the Bass Breaker 30R. Uh, you can change the knobs around and I'll play a little bit. Take it away. Thank you. 
So that was a look around the Fender Lost Highway Phaser pedal. It's a great pedal to add lots of different textures and depth to your sound. And for more information on the full line of Fender pedals, you can go to Fender.com to check those out. And stay tuned here for more videos. So what do you say I play us out? Sounds great.